What's up guys? So I have this wrap here to show you guys. This is an Ericsson. It's from Home Depot. Home Depot's website has it. I think it's like 350 or something. And this is a tri-fold ramp. So you can see it has hinges like this on folds. And then it has two straps with cam buckles on them. And those make it super nice so that when you have it unfolded, it hooks onto the hitch. If you have spots right there to hook it onto or maybe into the center somehow. And it has these ledges right here that will hook on to your tailgate. So mine just kind of hooks on right here. And that makes it super nice and smooth for when it comes up. That way you don't have any weird gaps or anything like that. All right, so I got the sled here and we're gonna go load it up, go for a ride, and I'll show you guys how it is when you unload it and then loading it back up at night. And you definitely want the straps to be super tight on that hitch or wherever you tie it because I have had it where this strap was a little bit twisted and not fully tightened like I thought it was and the thing actually fell off. Yo! <laughs> Yo! <laughs> That's kind of funny. So yeah, you definitely don't want that to happen. So you definitely want to make sure it's fully strapped on. I've even seen some people put on ratchet straps instead of this stuff. Alright, so my truck is a 2016 F-150 and this one has the long bed. So this is a 6.5. Just for reference, in case any of you guys have one, uh, you'll see how the ramps fit. So this is how I usually have them on the side of my sled. And with the tailgate open, it fits pretty much alongside the sled, doesn't stick out or anything. I have it in there, I could even put it up a little bit more. And then I usually just strap it down right here. The two straps attached to the hitch, you wanna make sure those are super tight. And then this, let's give it a little pull, try it out. And it should, should be good, it should move around. And you should be all set. That's it guys, uh, pretty easy, one person. So you could definitely do this by yourself if I can. That's it.